Hey guys, uh, so I'll be talking about today how we have verified uh, this uh, Nomad Relocation Packets and Momo uh, business listing in Google without postcard, without postcard, you know. So the method which we have used here, so for, uh, you know, this is very new technique which we have implemented over here. So. Uh, today we are going to talk about this google my business verification sorry we have i have written all right verification with new technique right so first you need a wordpress website right second you need a plugin which is wp maps pro plugin which is a paid plugin of uh, wordpress okay third you need to create a gmail account with the same number which you want to display on google my business means you want to live the location where you want the customer should call so same account should be created like same on the same number should be created if you don't know how to uh, how to create I'll, I'll i'll show you that uh which i'm talking about the, the how it should be so uh here again the fourth one is uh the website should not be used in another listing like it shouldn't be <coughs> duplicate or somewhere it is used in the same location right same location i'm talking about it shouldn't be used and the fifth point is very important which is this fifth point and this one and three is very important so fifth point is google maps api if you don't know what google maps api i'll show you again what is google maps api code <coughs> So let's dive into it. What exactly I'm talking about. So this is the listing which I, I have verified. No mad relocation for this address is Tulsi Theater and Marathi is in Bangalore location, right? We have verified here. You can see this number also is live. So I'll just uh, show some performance over here. It's been only few few days. Here he has got two calls till. So now. Uh, I'll just show the mails which we have sent to Google and we have got it verified so here if you will see here the this mail which is showing third third May yes third May right third May itself once you are going to create any business listing it is going to be suspended after right away once you are going to create the listing you are creating and right away it is going to suspend the suspension uh, uh, email will come to you then after you have to review this account and you have to submit the account the proofs so before that before uh, proceeding it uh, you need to have this uh, website over here as you can see over here this is uh, packers and movers here packers and movers marathi this website and uh, we have the plugin which is uh, WP Maps Pro there right so if I will show that on WP Maps Pro here if you'll come here is the add location which you have the uh, you know option so I have already created it I'll just show you that the uh, manage app you will go here you can see the company name the hand and the address the location exact uh, latitude and longitude you have to take so how you are going to take it so let's suppose you go to google map you go to google map and if you want to take the geo location you just click the right click let's suppose you want to create somewhere here and you just click on the right right click you can copy this one this so you required uh, latitude and longitude over here right so how you are going to do you once you will have this software uh, the plugin which you can say for uh, wordpress you go over here and you can go there add location before that i'll just uh, show that the setting here you can come come down to the setting one minute uh, WP Maps Pro here for that uh, plugin setting here you need 
a Google Maps API key, right? And why I'm saying it, this is going to help you for verifying Google Maps, uh, Google My Business listing. If you can see this in the code, which I have connected with, if you will test it, sorry, your, uh, you must enable billing on the cloud. It is showing some issue now. So once you will test it, it, it is going to tell you that it is verified. Okay, it will tell you that verified. It, it was verified now. Maybe some issues are there. I need to check that. Okay, so you need to copy the API key and you, you need to paste it over here and save the setting. That's it. After that, you have, you have to come over here and add location. Come here, add location. You put the company name. You put the address, latitude and longitude, which I have put city, state, what postal code, country, put that, and that's it. You just you need no need to do anything extra activity over here, just save the location. That's it. Of course, it is going to connect with directly with that location. This um, Google Maps API. So what exactly is the Google Maps API and the Google Maps? Even you can you have the Google Maps right over here. Even you can create the listing directly over here. But what is the difference? I'll just uh, show you over here. Uh, let's come to Google Bard. Google Bard. This is the Google Bard. Okay. This is Google Bard. Uh, the uh, it is similar to Chat GPT. Let's ask Google Bard that. Can we verify Google My Business profile uh, with the help of the Google Maps Pro? Connecting with Google Maps API. Let's see what it gives an answer. I have asked, can we verify Google My Business Profile with the help of WP Maps Pro connecting with the Google Maps API? Because that plugin needs to connect with the Google Maps API here. Yes, you can verify your Google Maps Profile with the help of Google Maps Pro connecting with the Google Maps API. Here are the steps how to do that. First, we need to install this app, this uh, plugin. Go to Google Maps Pro setting page and click to Google Maps API tab. Enter your Google Maps API key as I have shown you here. Uh, sorry. Here. As I have shown you here, you need to come in plugin setting and you need to paste the Google Maps API, right? So how you are going to do that one again, you have over here the create create Google Maps API. You need to just click. I'll just, I'm having uh, on another account. So I'll just uh, copy this one and uh, go to my this account and click on this. You have not to worry, you just click on this, uh, sorry, uh, you need to click on this, this. it will, uh, you know, redirect to that page only, okay, it will redirect to that page, so here I'll just show you, so I'm having this one on um, big five. <clears throat> So these are the these are the options which you need to enable maps JavaScript API. So what is the difference? That is what I was saying. If this Google Maps API itself has the 
all the access all the data uh, access to you uh, like it, it gives you uh, option to access all those data from google maps api itself geo coding api direction api distance matrix api maps elevation place api all those things will be enabled with this so just go enable it and create a new api key i'll just show you it live so here, here is the api key here is the api key let's go and change that one which i have created already so here i have pasted this test it congratulations the api key we created is perfect you can now start creating events it's very simple you need to create the account you need to connect with that right so google maps what, what google bard is saying enter the maps key api save the changes button go to google business go to the google my business so again you can click and verify that so after that what you have to do so let's suppose uh, <coughs> you created this one after that once it is verified you need to go to add location as i have told you go add the places over here and after creating this uh, this listing over here and you can see that listing here and this latitude and longitude will be connected directly connected to the google maps api okay then after you come over here and you go to your uh, like uh, or, or you can do over here uh, let's suppose right click and here is a add your business you can go and add your business as you want because i am unable to uh, add this business because it's google already has given me one permission to create that's it so you can go through your uh, uh, business account and you can create that listing then after you can verify it so as i have shown you here that we have uh, got it verified on third of my here the request which i have uh, put to the customer care thank you for con contacting the google business profile team about your business information being removed from google from the information information you provided i'm happy to confirm that we are able to reinstate the business profile for you no further action is required on third may itself it is verified so um, after filling the reinstatement form of the business location so this this software which i'm talking about it it gives you the flexibility here you can see google maps pro it is a 89 dollar i'll just uh, put the link in, uh, uh, inside the description you can go through that uh, link and you can purchase so here you can see the google maps pro is an advanced wordpress plugin that seamlessly integrates with the google maps into your website so this helps uh, any business owner or anybody who wants to create a google maps api or, or sorry google my business so he is able to create the google maps google my business easily so i am going to share this link uh, inside the you know, inside this video description so you can go and purchase and you can do yourself you can create multiple listings through this all right thank you